the learners were brimming with excitement as they explored the exhibition area. The event is playing a major role in educating young learners and the public about astronomy and the potential it holds for future generations. Many of the learners say they dream of working in astronomy one day. It just came to my mind at seventh grade since my teacher was so inspiring and everything. So I decided to try studying the stars a little bit. So after I studied the stars, constellations and everything, I just felt really inspired. So I just wanted to become an astronaut. So one day I could just touch the stars and make my mom proud, my dad. The reason why I love astronomy I started when I was so fascinated about the planets, the stars, and basically everything beyond planet Earth. So that really interested me and it created a good curiosity. Therefore, I want to study in astronomy to um, satisfy that curiosity. At school we have um, STEM club, which is, is a club where um, we explore and um, apply our knowledge that we learn from our subjects and create new um, things and to learn about. Um, we also have like engineering and science, so I'm really interested in science to learn about um, astronomy and everything more. Some of the high school educators say they have programs in place that will help to promote astronomy and science. Astronomy is one of the key uh, subjects that basically is done in term four in grade eight and nine, which, which is basically earth and beyond. And I, I'm glad to be here because now when I talk to my learners about the planets and the solar system, basically they will now be exposed to what basically they are, they, uh, they've seen and talked about within these astronauts that they basically will see. We generally go into the STEM field. So one of the biggest things that Spine Road High School is doing, we have a massive robotics club. So the robotics includes coding, we take part in the WRO competitions. Um, so basically that is the way in which we try to, um, let's say, push forward critical thinking in our learners. Right? And then also another thing that we do do, we take part in the Science Expo. When we take part in the Science Expo, we are basically exposing our learners to all the other projects. So obviously they're doing their own project, but they're also being exposed to all the, the other projects. We are in relationship with WCD that uh, created a private organization by, ran by CT, uh, Cape Town Science Center, a STEM club where we actually expose learners to different projects given by them, ordained by the curriculum, obviously. But also we do take our learners to Cape Town Science Centre for them to, be get, uh, to get more exposed to, to astronomy and to the things that they, sh they can get from people who are more experienced than us in the field at uh, Cape Town Science Centre. Alongside its significant international scientific impact, the General Assembly will also have a societal impact that goes beyond national barriers. Corbin August, SABC News, Cape Town.